Welcome back. Alicia Nelson is here from Emeritus uh, at Saddleback um, College, and she is going to talk to us about fitness and a variety of different fitness classes that you teach. Is it at Saddleback College, or is it somewhere close to here? Um, we have classes at Laguna Woods. Right. Um, the class that I do is in Clubhouse One. Oh, good. At the gym, um, and. Um, I do other classes through Emeritus. We are all over um, the local area, Mission Viejo, mm -hmm. uh, Lake Forest, um, down San Clemente. Okay. I can't think of all the places. I'm also in Dana Point. Okay, um, so you're everywhere. Well, that's good. Yes. So let's just talk about the one, not necessarily just the one at the clubhouse, but maybe some that are also close by. So you do, a, I, I saw aerobic exercise to music. Now, yes. of course, most aerobic classes are to music. What kind of music do you choose? Um, I, um, I mix it up quite a lot. I do... Um, Everything has a, a beat so okay. that there's, um, it's energetic and um, we do music from the 30s, 40s, 50s, 60s, 70s, 80s, throw in a couple uh, modern songs um, and um, yeah, okay. I take suggestions so if you ever have something that you would like to hear. <laughs> oh perfect, all right good. Now you also teach, you teach aquatics fitness so that is here at our pools? The pools here, yes. Um, I have only subbed for those classes, but we offer, okay. through Saddleback um, Emeritus, we offer a lot of classes, pool classes, aquatic mm -hmm. fitness, um, Pilates, stretching, chair exercise, oh, okay. Okay. yoga. So lots of different things. Lots of different classes. Yeah, I mean, there's always something, I swear, that Emeritus has so many things to offer people. Yes, they do. What are some of the things that you like uh, about, about teaching fitness? Um, well, I love to motivate and get people uh, moving. Um, I have a lot of people saying they have, they have better attitudes, they're feeling better, mm -hmm. they can move better, they can get around the house, they can carry more groceries, okay. they're not falling as much, right. not having balance issues. So right. there's so many benefits of exercise. So I love hearing stories from my students about right. how they're seeing benefits. Um, I like to get the classes motivated and moving together. If you're mm -hmm. uh, nervous about exercising and don't really want to get started, um, come check out one of the classes and you'll see just the energy when you're in a group together. Mm -hmm. We have anywhere from 40 to 60, sometimes more students in a okay. class. Um, so there's a lot of people and you might see people that you know already. Mm -hmm. um, and having that accountability of having a group class and having right. friends with you right. um, is huge to get right. you to keep on moving your body. Well, that's great. And then do you uh, have any assistance in the class or is it just yourself? Um, it's just myself. Okay. Um, each of us, instructors, health instructors, um, do it. Okay. Single-handedly. Well, that's a lot. That's a lot of people, but that's good. But I think I like that what you mentioned is that if you find a friend mm -hmm. in the class, that's nice because the two of them can show up together exactly. and they can talk about what, oh gosh, I couldn't do this okay. or I couldn't do that and then work on them helping each other. So that's yes. kind of a nice idea too. Um, what, what got you involved in exercise? Um, well, what got me involved in exercise? Um, well, I was, my parents put me in sports when I was little. Okay. Um, and moving on through there, I was, I competed in college um, track. Okay. And um, moving on from there, I actually was a classroom teacher, okay. um, elementary school, and I taught PE. All right. And then decided to get my certification for personal training and in okay. the summers I would do personal training okay. um, and then I got a job at a gym that our our focus population were seniors okay. um, and just loved it there um, and then my parents are I've tried for years to get my parents to get active and get their bodies moving and it never happened. And so now I feel like I am in a room full of moms and dads that I can help and um, 
just there's so many benefits to exercise oh, and yeah. being able to help people get their lives back right. and being living healthier right. um, that's what motivates me for fitness and getting into exercise right well that's great my um my father's 89 and oh, we my. moved him out of the state because yes. he just wasn't feeling real good here uh -huh. but he went there and he found a fitness class and there he you also go. found aquatics class. Very nice. So he didn't own anything so, you know, that were related to the aquatic stuff. Mm -hmm. But I will say that it helps COPD yes. for him, which I really found remarkable that mm -hmm. it can help your breathing. So yeah. how, how does it help breathing? Um, well, your aerobic, um, anytime you're working, you're, you think of your aerobic system as as like a muscle. It's not a muscle, but think of it that way. And so you're training your, your aerobic system to your lung capacity um, increases when you are using it. So okay. um, as your heart rate increases and you start to breathe more and you're opening your lungs and it's, mm -hmm. you're, it's like your lungs are working out and mm. so that increases your ability to breathe better. Right, so with that said, if you are experiencing those types of issues, you know, maybe the first class and the second class, don't be alarmed. Don't be alarmed, okay. but you should always get checked out by a doctor okay. before you start any kind of exercise routine okay. that's standard uh, <laughs> across okay, the board. Um, but don't be afraid to try the exercise classes. Um, you can, they can be modified for any, if you, if you have knee pain or back pain or any kind of injury, modifications can be made. And okay. um, I would encourage you if you are taking the class to um, talk to your instructor and let them know if you do have any concerns. Okay. And um, all the instructors are well qualified to be able to okay. do some mod modifications for uh, keeping you safe. Well, and I would imagine that because of your personal training that you have, and you also have a master's degree in education. So, so is that that's fitness education, correct, or is that just education overall? My bachelor's is in um, exercise biology, and then oh, I went okay. on and got my master's in education. Okay. Um, so education, it was actually K twelve education. Oh, gotcha. Okay. But then um, I, through then getting my personal training cert certifications, yeah. um, and I try to go to conferences and yeah. keep myself um, up to date on okay. current fitness uh, yeah. industry things. So. Well, and then the exercise biology also, you have to understand what the body is doing. So that's good that you have modifiers for people who maybe can't do this or can't do that. So that's excellent. Well, good. Well, you've got the 2020 semester coming up, which begins in mid-November. So that's right around the corner. Registration begins oh, in registration. November. Um, the class Sorry. doesn't begin until January, but okay, the registration right. will Yeah, but you're going to probably start. fill up, I'm sure. We do. Um, the classes, most of the classes do get full. Um, if there is a full class, you do not have to, don't think, oh, I can't go. Go to the first few classes, talk to the instructor, instructors, and um, we're usually able to add, because there's a lot of people that get signed up that don't end up coming. So. Right. Um, don't just look at a class and say it's full, I can't go. Try it, talk to the instructor, and most of the time we're able to get you in. Okay, perfect. Well, thank you so much. It was very You're nice welcome. to meet you. Nice you have such a lovely too. demeanor. Well, thank I you. can't imagine anybody not walking out of your class without a smile on their thank face. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. And remember, uh, this 2020 spring semester applications are being taken mid-November. And just to let you know that her aerobics classes are taught, other ones to music, on Mondays and Wednesdays. And we'll be right back.